Guys, we're playing the Artful Escape today. Nephew of Johnson Vendetti. Who's Johnson Vendetti? Francis Vendetti. Tomorrow evening, 8 p.m. Uh, I suppose Francis is our main character. I don't know a lot about the game. First playthrough. I think it is a rhythm game. It looks cool. I think I've um, seen videos of it years ago. Somewhere online and thought, oh, no, that's a nice idea. Um, but usually I'm not that much into... I think it's a side scroller, more, more or less, but that's usually not my kind of thing. But um, it's time to get out of the comfort zone. And especially with me being a drummer and this being a rhythm game and that guy, I think, wanting to be a rock star. Let's see what it is all about. Now you best believe he's grateful indeed. Pretty sure that game has an amazing soundtrack. I hope. I'm I'm I'm, I'm sure about that. Pretty sure about that. To strum a folk ballad about the toil of a miner's life called Square? Are you a miner? Are we a miner? You okay, buddy? To play a folk anthem about the green acreage of Calypso, Colorado. Country roads, take me home. Well, I'm not American, so cannot talk about home here. West Virginia isn't my home, but maybe it is his. To shred a sci-fi guitar, what do you say? Hold square. No? Okay, you now we're talking. Can I let go, by the way? I can let go. That is pretty epic. Not gonna lie. Oh, who's that? Your look doesn't match your sound. <gasps> Fair enough. Excuse me? You dress like a drifter, but you sound like a space opera. <laughs> Complete tonal disconnect. Gives me anxiety. Oh, sorry. That that was. I'm I'm usually much more serious. I play folk music. You look like you do. I mean, I'm trying to write for this show. My first show. Uh huh. But after a while, it feels like I'm strumming backwards. My mind wanders away. Where to? Uh, my mind wanders away to unfathomable depths of space, mid nebula suspended uh, suspended in a sunbeam, planets without names. Um. Um. Planets without names. Planets without names. You seem a little lost, kid. Which is good. Sometimes that that's good. I find lost young men are in the business of irrational and dangerous decisions. Wouldn't you agree? I'm the danger diabolic. Uh, I wasn't listening, not sure about dangerous, but I am irrational. Uh, are we be confident about that. I'm the danger diabolic. Excellent. I need you to accompany me to the summit on Leaf Road Ridge. I'm going to commit a crime. Um... And who are you? Who are you? I'm Violetta. I can assure you there's nothing strange about me at all. And what do we do? What's the crime? The best kind. The mysterious kind. Uh... 
I, I guess I don't have another option but to do it. Okay. I'll do it. I knew you would. Dope. We're committing a crime? I don't know if that is really that dope. Oh, okay. Can we run? Yes, we can. Jump. Scenic lookout. The summit. Kids come here to hang out. At least they used to. A lot of folks moving on from Calypso. Well, then we go to the summit. I like the art style of the game. It looks very pretty. I mean, I usually say that uh, to every game that does look a bit different than the usual AAA games. I like games that try something different. Summit of Leaf Road Ridge. And we hear some music. Johnson Vendetti's nephew. From? After party. For your show. For my show. Rami's gonna move the crowd up here after the liquor license scratches. The skiffle band is playing. They really love Skiffle, good for them. They're quite forceful with their opinions on Skiffle. I will give him a chance. Uh, what is Skiffle? I'll give, I'll give them, them a, a chance. chance. Plug into the amp on stage. I'll patch you in. Is this your stuff? Of course not. Oh. Guess we're gonna get up on stage. Where are the drums? I mean, okay, yeah, fair enough. He doesn't have a band. There are no drums. He's a solo guy. But where, where are the drums of the other band? Stop! No Johnson Vendetti clone folk. Play the stuff from the lookout. Oh, no. Seriously, that's nonsense. It was pretty good, man. Hey! When it comes to nonsense, I'm one of the greats. Play. That one. Play again. That's worse than the first one. Bonanza. That's it. And we're getting off stage now. Was that the sound check? What Guess that was the sound check. Nothing. Valves. Later. Uh, all right, sure. See you Wait, later. Is this Rami stuff? You're stealing valves from Rami? Yeah. So. He killed a man in Boulder. Everyone says so. Punched him in the neck. I know. I'm Francis. Francis Vendetti. I know who you are, kid. I saw the flyers. There's a very tiny picture of you on it. I never signed off on the flyers. You ever made it to the top? Been too scared to try. Oh, hello.
Whoa, it's beautiful. Yeah, you could really kill yourself from up here. <laughs> you shred pretty well for a folk singer. Uh, I'm okay. I'm okay. So you're standing in the shadows of Johnson Vendetti, huh? He's my uncle. That must suck. It ain't so bad. It's just that I guess folks think they know who I am. Where I should be going. Hmm. So his uncle is a folk guy. But he rather wants to do something different. He wants to shred. Have you considered becoming someone else entirely? How do you mean? Might tell you about it someday. I gotta scram. Stay weird, kid. Hey! Will I see you around town? You know Lightman's in Calypso? In Calypso? There's no such place. Maybe you're not looking hard enough. Someone else entirely. Rami finds out I was up here when his gear got stolen. Well, I'd rather not think about it. I'm gonna book it back to town and forget the whole thing. An opponent in oh yeah, okay, that's the uh, that's the developer. Oh, that's a published up. Beethoven, uh, Beethoven and dinosaurs. And dinosaur. It's an interesting name for a um, game studio. I like it. It's um. Uh, I know that woman. It's a soft, just black almond bird when she touches the sky. And you've got no. They hired Sir Sir Lannister. That's and you nice. Don't know just why you're a child of the river coming home. Tonight, sweet rose of pine, lost in your wind tonight. Will you run, baby, run, baby, far from home, where the banks of the rivers are lying. So his uncle is basically the face of the state. <laughs> Where are we going? Hello, Kitty. Francis, you little bastard. Oh, wow. Come to me, my love. Goldie. Okay. You lose it? Perhaps a bit. I have a ticket to your recital. Got a lot of new material. Probably an album's worth. I think when you're beneath those lights, I might catch a glimpse of my old friend. You will believe it's 1955. Believe it's 1955. You look like him, you know. Your uncle. I know, Goldie. I really do. I think this place used to be a watchmaker, undeniably haunted, possible hub of underage drinking. Damn it, that's cheap. Maybe it's really 1955. Hey, Tao. Yo, I've never seen so many people in town. Yeah, it's horrible. You listen to that record? Yeah. I kind of loved it, actually. Now that surprises me. What with you being a, a serious folk musician? 
Yeah, you can't be serious lately. Keep spacing out. You ever heard of Lightmans? I'll catch you later. Let's ask him about Lightmans. You ever heard of Lightmans? Mm. Junk sci-fi movie. It, it's not a movie. It's a place. <laughs> it ain't in this dead end. Um. Yeah. Can't be serious lately. Keep spacing out. You gotta let it happen, man. Play blues, play funk, blow minds. Yeah, sure. Let's see what I can do. I'll catch you later. Catch tell. you later, Tal. Calypso is usually much quieter. It's it quieter each summer, the old folks say. People are here for the anniversary of my uncle's album, Pines. It's kind of like a festival. Everyone's pretty excited. Ah, I see. So he's basically the opener for his uncle. The Johnson Vendetti Festival ends tomorrow night. Finale is at the Salty Seagull, where Johnson Vendetti's nephew will take the stage for the first time. That's me. You avoiding me, son? No, Rami, no. I find you very intimidating. What am I doing, Francis? You... I have no idea. I'm smiling. That's it. And when I'm smiling, you know I don't mean nothing shady or untoward. Despite the gravity of the words I might be speaking. Right. We got a full house tomorrow night. My face is friggin' hurting. I'm smiling so much when I say... You will play songs exclusively from the personal repertoire of your uncle, or you will misplace take. Well then, I suppose we have an accord. And make sure you show your face at the after party, huh? Why would he play... Oh wait, is his uncle dead? He is taking on his uncle's legend in some way. Cafe cliche. Their pastries are in the shape of a villain's gnarled grin. Let's go up here. Hey, you're Johnson Vendetti's kid. Nephew. Sure, whatever. Saw the flyers for his show, man. Probably won't check it out, though. Okay, whatever. Don't mean nothing nasty, honestly. I'm sure you're a good kid. But you've got no chance. Of what? Johnson Vendetti was a folk mastermind. Once in a generation. And genius ain't hereditary, kid. Well, always nice to get the thoughts of an industry heavyweight. Yeah, that's true. He's just uh, playing some music out Is in the Sondra street and leaving? thinks he can tell us off. What happened? Intrigue, laser lights, shops disappearing in the night. I won't put up with it. Who's got lasers? Don't mind all that. I'm leaving. Aren't you sad? Of course I'm sad, even though I just met you. Sandra, I'm devastated. Yours is the only shop I bother to steal from. Lies, lies. You can come visit me down the road in Donnybrook. Here, choose a book. From me to you. A morbid psychedelia. A scientist poisons his town's water supply to appear to them as an alien being. Wings of Orion. A, ki a king disguises himself as a piece of overcast sky. Velochrome, using an illegal avatar, a mutant rises through the aristocracy of a cyber city. Uh. What? Uh, I, I sort of like the cover of that one. Whoa. Well, aren't you gonna thank me? I'm sorry. I think I was having an epiphany. Well, savor it, my friend. What I wouldn't give for a good epiphany. 
Hey, you ever heard of a place called Lightman's? Francis, I don't think you want to be... <clears throat> Actually, no. Never mind. I've never heard of it. Now run along. Go practice. Uh, sure. Let's go and practice then. I don't even know where I'm running to. Can get another... Uh... I never recognize anyone who eats here. Probably a hub for time travelers. Um, uh, hello? Francis Vendetti. The pleasure's all mine. Mayor Swartz here. How did you know... I like to have my ear to the ground, my boy. Felt the vibrations. Ready for the big show? Uh, it, yeah, just rounding off the corners. Excellent, excellent, really. The town's counting on you, son. What with businesses closing up, low voter morale, mayoral corruption. Haven't you been the mayor for like 12 years? <laughs> and a series of unexplainable events that have no basis in fact whatsoever. You can put them right out of your head. Unexplainable events? I shouldn't speak about it over the phone. All I'm saying is this. Your show's important, Vendetti. There's a lot of folks out there counting on you. Wow. Okay. The show is important. Don't cock it up. Uh, we try to. We will try to. So no messing up the show. Here we have two ladies making out in the background. Uh, let's see. I, I don't know where we're actually heading to. I can head further up. Maybe we're gonna also check out the right side. Of uh, that lift. Let's see where that is leading us to. What have you come as? Zombie Vendetti. That is in poor taste. Zombie Vendetti. So if that is of poor taste, I suppose he really is dead. And Francis, our boy here, carries his uncle's legacy. His songs. Performing them. But he actually doesn't, doesn't want to be a copy of his uncle. He wants to make his own stuff. We heard it, he's not a folk guy. He wants to shred the guitar. Let's head up here then, and see where that is taking us. Probably the next level of people, shops. Nothing here. Hey, Lucy. Uh, I'm supposed to tell everyone we got Johnson Vendetti's 20th anniversary release of Pines in stock. I've got a copy, Lucy. The folk masterpiece. The voice of an American generation, or whatever. 12 million copies sold. Okay, yeah. Lucy, you got any records by people pretending to be someone else? I mean, sure. We got Captain Beefheart. Legendary Stardust Cowboy. Oh, Hank Williams pretended to be a character called Loop the Drifter. Hank Williams? Really? Why would he do that? Just say stuff he couldn't say as Hank Williams. Ideas? Whoa. You okay? Yeah. I keep spacing out. You, you coming, coming to the, the show, show tonight? I'll go to the show. I'm not going to the after party. You don't like the Skiffle band? They're like Jimmy Page started in Skiffle. <laughs> yeah, everyone loves Jimmy for his Skiffle. Exactly. You ever heard of a place called Lightman's? A place called Lightman's? Mm, no. You want me to check out back? Nah, got a feeling you won't find it. Thanks, Lucy. Alright, bye, Lucy. Take care. My place. 
childhood home of Johnson Vendetti. It's a shrine and a tomb. All right, I guess we're gonna head in there then. Let's see if there's anything here with to the right. No, just a nice, beautiful view. Alrighty, um... Let's see what is inside of there. So, what I get now from the game, so far it's just running around, not a lot... Rhythm gaming, but... Uh, someone... This, this Johnson Van Daddy was pretty huge. Huge musician. I think he's dead, and us, his nephew, carries on his legacy to play the songs every year at a festival. But, um, we are actually, although we obviously love our uncle and want to honor his legacy, we, that's just not our kind of thing. So, um, I'm excited to see where the game is heading and what our Francis here is uh, playing in the end what kind of music what type of music and if he is hopefully shredding his guitar